Welcome to the 12th Annual Miss Hooters International Swimsuit Pageant. Representing San Antonio, Texas, I am Sarah Hibbs. I prepared for the contest just by doing, you know, working out, you know, trying to limit my, you know, brownie intake. I love to eat pizza and stuff like that, and, you know, good old barbecue in Texas, is, it's hard to beat. So I try to limit my intake on that. I also, you know, was tanning, you know, getting my hair done, and any, any, anything to get ready for the pageant. Your winner of the 12th annual Miss Hooters International Swimsuit Pageant is... Number 110, Sarah Hoots from Texas. My plans on the $50,000, I'm trying to be smart with it. Um, I really wasn't expecting it. That part really hasn't hit me yet. I want to, I guess, try and invest some of it. Um, maybe get a hybrid, because I kind of need one of those with driving around big old spread out San Antonio. And pay off some school loans. <laughs> I started working at Hooters on a dare. All of my friends called me Hooterless because of my last name, and you know, I was kind of Hooterless. <laughs> so they, you know, they took me in there. That was the first time ever in Hooters, and it was so much fun, and the waitress was so awesome. I just, I couldn't wait to apply, and I couldn't wait to start working and get those orange shorts. My career goes with Hooters. I think they're met. Um, I reached my goal with, with Miss Hooters International. I'd love to, you know, move up in the company. I'd love to, you know, work for corporate. But if that doesn't work out, I'd love to also become a pediatric PA or also a trauma PA. My hobbies include snuggling on the couch. I'm a huge cuddle bug. I can't help but watch movies. And just, I have a big old dog, so he's about weighs as much as me. So it's, I have a big king bed. So you know, with all my family and stuff like that, my cat, my dog, and my boyfriend, it kind of takes up a lot of space. 